Oh, he could totally Don't have too much fun. We'll see. You are my new best friend. Ah, Ryder. I'd like to introduce you to my new best friend. What's your name again? Samrick. Right, right. Samrick here has been so sympathetic about Pock being stolen. He used to run with our pal Kalinda, and he knows where her crews congregate. Safe houses, rallying points, etc. I trust he's telling you what you need to know? Well... Look, uh, I appreciate the drinks and the flattery and all, but Kalinda doesn't take kindly to people discussing her business interests. She busted me up pretty bad when she kicked me out of her outfit. I don't really want to repeat. You might have more immediate fears, don't you think? You've survived what Kalinda dishes out, but you have no idea what Ryder can do. And after you spill your guts, Kalinda will punish you herself for talking anyway. So why take an extra beating? All right, all right. Shit, you people don't play fair. Thanks, Ryder. I think he'll cooperate now. I'll know where to look for Pop soon. all over this region. You'd think we'd run out of people to steal from. And all we're on courses. Sam, send Kalo the nav point provided by our Krogan contact. Drac, we're landing on Elodin to rendezvous with Jorgal Strux. On my way. Where is this meeting place exactly? Called the Paradise. Middle of nowhere, as far as I can tell. Paradise is different for a Krogan. I will gather what information I can, Pathfinder. lives here besides the Krogan? Scavengers with nothing to lose. Criminals chucked out of Kadara. Gonna be interesting. Beautiful, isn't it? I remember the first time I saw this place, I thought, wow, this is home. I wasn't the only one. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. I said I wouldn't do it. Almost Environment check. It. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Life support at 100%. What are you looking at? Hey, hey! 
Welcome, welcome. Come this way. Follow me. That's a fancy ship, all right. You'll find lots of deals inside. Ugh. Just talk to my boss. Come on, this way. This is a special place. The paradise. No guns here. Keep those holstered. This way. Come inside. There's a bunch of low-life scavengers inside. But don't worry. Sure, beyond these walls they'll shoot you on sight, but you're safe here. It's a fair exchange. Why, because you say it is? Partly. I wouldn't be in business if I wasn't fair. If you don't... Welcome to the paradise. Uh, thanks. So, what do you think? What do you mean, what do I think? I mean, look around! No guns, no blood, no violence. Outside the gates, you're on your own. But in here, you're safe. Anyone violates the peace, they have to answer to me. Yeah, everyone's on their best behavior. Is it natural, or are they on something? Huh. <laughs> Nothing so complicated. These people need me. They need what I sell, so they behave, or they're out. Now what can I get you? How can I help? Just let me know. You have a pretty good attitude for a place like this. I've got nothing to complain about. I'm rich, and no one messes with me. Most powerful woman on Elodin. Yeah? I don't mean to brag, but absolutely. What else is here? I'm a businesswoman, not a tour guide, but I'll tell you what I know if it suits me. Who lives on this planet? Desperate folks, mostly. Misfits, some. Those that can't get along in the regular world. Or people willing to make a profit off that desperation. Like you? Careful, sweetheart. You want to keep me on your good side. There's a place they call the Flop House, east-ish of here. Den of murder and misery. You should pay it a call. What can you tell me about that derelict ship? Ah, oh, you came here to get killed, did you? Scavengers are trying to pull it apart, is all I know. I don't go near their claims. They shoot on sight. You get along with the Krogan? Everyone comes to Elodin with the dream of leaving. Except me and the Krogan. They built their colony into a sinkhole. Smart. Keeps it cool enough for them, I guess. They have their own water? Unfortunately for them, no. But Mordor and I get along well, so far. I'm supposed to meet a Krogan here named Strux? Look around. If my customers have names, I don't know them. It's better that way. I'll look around. Well, well, look at you. I'm good at reading people. Want me to guess who you are? Shoot. A Pathfinder. How did you know? How do you know? I cheated. I run salvage to Kadara. Word travels fast there. Should hear what the Collective is saying about you. Well, now I'm curious. I will repeat it, for your sake. Ever work with a guy named Reyes? Reyes? He's one of my buyers, actually. You know him? He used to. Know where he is? Haven't heard from him in a while, actually. No one has. For all I know, he's living it up on the Nexus. Take it easy. Always do. Jorgal Strux? Maybe. You who I think you are? I'm the Pathfinder from the Nexus. 
You asked me to meet you here. Yeah, I did. Thanks for coming. Losing the Krogan was a big deal to a lot of us in the Initiative. Some of my best friends are Krogan. That's right. I didn't want to leave the Nexus, but I needed to support my people and my clan. So, trouble at the colony? It's heading to a bad place. We can't be there anymore. Morda's become a tyrant. Did she kick you out? It hasn't come to that yet, so we're laying low. I want to keep my eye on her. She's planning a strike against the Nexus, that much we know. Drac trusts Morda, and I trust Drac. Hearn, Morda's leading the colony for a reason. She's tough, but that's good. You're not there, Drac. Morda is going to rip this colony apart. And then we're all going to die. Krogan dying? Tough bastards like you? Everyone needs food and water, even Krogan. Morda's rationing. My group thinks the Krogan should make peace with the Nexus. We all came here with our past and our baggage. With such deep conflicts, peace may be impossible. Well, there won't be a colony to make peace with if Morda ruins it. You don't believe me? Go to the Krogan colony yourself and see what she's planning. Talk to Ravenar Brink. He's one of us, on the inside. If the safety of the Nexus is really on the line, I'll go. Better hope she doesn't shoot me on sight. Yeah, that'd be a bad omen. So, Elodin. Charming so far. What do we got, besides the sand? The Revenant Monolith suggests this was indeed supposed to be a golden world. It also suggests the presence of a vault. Additionally, here is the large derelict Revenant ship that we saw as we landed. Hopefully abandoned. Scans indicate it is not. The site is active with scavengers and remnant bots. Here, scavengers have taken over an abandoned camp between the two. In this direction, located in one of the planet's sinkholes, is New Tachanka, the Krogan colony. Sinkholes. Sounds fun. Not really. Elodin is tidily locked to its sister moon and that gas giant above. This side of the moon never cools. Getting trapped in a sinkhole without shelter would mean certain death as one's blood would boil in 75 seconds. And on that cheery note, let's head for the climate-controlled paradise of the Nomad. What's the worst trouble you've ever been in, Drac? Look around. Really? You've been alive 1400 years and this is the worst? Trouble always feels worst when you're in it. Everything else is just a good story. levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Pathfinder, I detect broken scavenger machinery ahead. to set up any kind of working colony on this hillscape. Amazing's about right. Maybe crazy. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. levels are climbing, Pathfinder. Activating automated forward station deployment. You to 
Junta coming up. Mining zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your nav system. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Coming! Move along. No outsiders. She's with me. Human Pathfinder. Drac. It's been a while. Jorgel Strux sent me. I'm supposed to talk with Morda. So now Strux is friends with the Nexus. Traitor. Think I'm a traitor too? Shut it, Greg. Don't make me headbutt you. I absolutely will. Uh, tougher than you look. All right, go ahead. I'll spread the word so Morda knows you're here. Good. <laughs> Pathfinder must think she's pretty tough to just stroll in here. I wonder how long she'd last in a real fight. They're testing you. Seeing if you'll take the bait. Coming! Should've known. He tastes something different about the Rin call. Been out of the Sea of Ataraxia? Pretty wild out there. They'll kill you for a tire. Saw the worm bust straight through an old ship? Not a scratch on it. Some soft, squishy human like you should probably steer clear of the wildlife out there. You said something about a worm. Not a worm. The worm. Huge. Invincible. You can't miss it. It pops out of the dunes from time to time. Plows down everything in its path. Do I have to worry about it attacking? As far as we can tell, it doesn't care about us one way or the other. But stay out of its way. It'll barrel right through you, tear you to pieces. Thanks for the heads up. You Ravener Brank? Strux sent me. He said hey. that you... Yes. Find me later near the fighting pit. Hey, Nexus. I'm the one you talk to around here. Are you Morda? I'm Nakmar Morda, overlord of the Krogan in Helios. Overlord? Drac, Kesh said you had a new job. She didn't tell me you did. And you're the celebrated Pathfinder from the Hyperion, found at last. I'm Ryder. This is thrilling. I've never stood so close to a Pathfinder before. Mostly because the Krogan never got one. Welcome to New Tachunka. I understand you and your people are pissed off. Humans were welcomed into the Citadel Council with open arms, while the Krogan endured centuries of oppression. You have no idea. Your understanding only makes me mad. Okay, gotcha. Loud and clear. Why are you here, Pathfinder? To see what a successful colony looks like? I work for the Initiative, and we paid your way here. You left us, so leave us alone. Any Krogan action against the Nexus will be considered a war crime, or murder. Murder? Human, have you ever seen a Krogan stillbirth? Get out of my face before I smash it. A pleasure catching up with the new Krogan hierarchy. See you soon. Mort is a hard ass, but that surprised even me. Not good. Yeah, maybe. You called out action against the Nexus and she said nothing. Let's talk to Brank before we freak out. Ran into some of the
So you're the human Pathfinder. You look different from the pictures I saw. That's a relief. I love my dad, but to be honest, my hair's way nicer. Your dad? You replaced him as Pathfinder? It's a long story. Haven't really kept up with Nexus news. Enough trouble to occupy me here. Scavengers? Amongst other things. You seen the Flophouse yet? That's where they get together. 80% shacks, 100% trouble. I'll give you the nav point so you can avoid it. Or not, as you choose. Have you had much trouble with the scavengers at the colony? Not yet. They're not that stupid. A bunch of squishies against a hundred odd Krogan? Give it a little time. Resources run low, they'll get desperate. And who knows? Tell me more about the flop house. It's a loose collection of shelters where some scavenger gangs gather. They knock each other around, drink, and then when they're all riled up, run raids. And if you get close when they're hungry, well, that's how I lost a liver and gained a limp. Thanks. This information will come in handy. Just trying to help. Be careful out there, Pathfinder. Ravenor Brank. Quiet. Anyone tells Morda I'm talking to you and I'm kicked out. Spit out what you know and I'll take it from there. Okay, okay. I said quiet, not rude. What? Did you see the crashed ship as you landed? Morda's after the drive core. That's Remnant. No way she can use it. What are you talking about? She's building a bomb. With the drive core as a power source. Sam? Dangerous to those handling it, but, in the end, very possible. Demolition teams have been busting down walls for months, battling those robots and scavengers. Lots here want peace with the Nexus. If Morda gets that drive core, boom, it's over. Now get away from me. Thanks, Frank. <laughs> 